There we go. Okay, they did pick. It is going to be Residential House. Residential House is coming up next in game number two. We're going to get uh, everyone loaded in and setting that up. And uh, go ahead and watch ya. Uh, or watch these uh, these two guys. It'll be Commando Delta on the attack for game two. So I, I, just kind of going into the uh, that's super today because now, now you're going to have Commando Delta attacking um, and on Residential House their attack record is a little bit better. We already talked about earlier how uh, Commando Delta has an attack record across the whole league of 22.5%. Um, that's the number of rounds that they've won on attack. But here on Residential House um, where they'll be attacking, they've won about 31.3% of their rounds. They've played Residential House four times. Um, and then last week, they got their first win of the season on Residential House. So maybe they're looking for lightning to strike twice here as they choose uh, Residential House with Mob on defense. Now, for Mob, that's I know what you're asking. Now you're asking, okay, well, how does Mob fare on this? By the way, all of these stats are available um, on the Gilded, exclamation point IEL, and that'll give you uh, all of the details uh, that I'm uh, reading out to you right now. But Mob's defensive record on this map is a 66.7. They've won two-thirds of their defenses on this map. Um, however, on the attacking side, they've only won... 16.7%. 16.7. Their attack record is worse on this map than um, what we saw with uh, Commando Delta just a moment ago. So I think this is going to end up being a, a really close one. We'll see. Um, m perhaps maybe even a runaway for Commando Delta. I don't know. We'll, we'll, we'll see what happens here. Um, I mean, here you have two teams that are strong at defending. But Commando Delta, in their case, is stronger on this map, attacking. And for Commando Delta, you're going to have Slay X, Crusader, Hendrix, Artis, Flex. And for Mob, it's going to be MedTech, The One, Tony Montana, Just Chili, Father Mods, and Fly Like an Eagle. First Floor Kitchen is going to be the objective location for Mob. Father Mods goes right out to place that sticky cam there. Deploying in 10 um... I'm wondering, I'm, no, that, I think Showcase is blocked. I don't even think they can go in through that way. Locate and defuse the bomb. Uh, Hendrix is going to be the point man with the uh, shield. You hear out of breath out there is we can find out who that is. Might be Fly Like an Eagle, or it might be Montana, Tony Montana, yeah. Who gets shot up there from below, down to 38 health. He's got trouble down there. Fly like an eagle will get a C4 kill on Crusader. Has to go down to avoid the shield is Tony Montana and Flex will cover. 4v4. Talked about earlier how Crusader entered the series with the negative six entry. He picked up two plus two at least on the last round as Slayx gets to kill on Medtech. But Crusader once again is the first death. Your soul oh, that nade is beautiful by Father Mods. Did he get taken out too as well? I, did, I must have missed that. I was just so in awe of, of that nade. <laughs> it is 2v2. Fly like an eagle is holding a nasty angle here, and I don't know why you'd go up. Hendrix is going to challenge Fly like an eagle up top. 
but the objective is down on the first floor. I mean, yes, you don't want to totally ignore what's upstairs, but I think this is a distraction that's going to be costly for Commando Delta. Now coming up to charge Fly Like an Eagle. Fly Like an Eagle will get the kill on Hendrix, and Artis will get Fly Like an Eagle. But now Just Chili has a little bit more freedom to push up, and he's going to go cover the 90. Probably should have been a little bit more aggressive. But, uh, yeah, that's... Uh, that's a mistake, I think, on Commando Delta's part, to go challenge Fly Like an Eagle up those stairs. Now, now artist believes somebody might just be down below him is going to throw a frag out there, but just Chili's all the way out in maids now. Even just Chili has forfeited 90. Just Chili with a health advantage only slightly. The artist is down at 89. Ooh, that nade is going to be just short of just Chili. And just chili is fixed. Artist is going to be left trying to peek here. Now going to try to relocate at the end of the hall. He's got 45 seconds left to accomplish something here. Now out of stamina as he relocates the drawing room. And I think at this point it's over. You just save the gun. Because you still, even if you do get just chili right now, you, you've got to still defuse the bomb. And he's got 20 seconds to do that. Meaning to start the defuse. I know it said 30 seconds left, but it takes 10 seconds to defuse the bomb. Just Chili will close the door. That's going to waste enough time for Artist to have no chance at getting this defuse. No chance at all. He does get Just Chili. He starts it. Wait a minute. He might have just started it with like 10 and a half seconds left. If he holds this, this is going to come down to a fraction of a second. No way. Commando Delta actually pulled that off with literally one second left. The fate that was just challenged in that round. Holy! What a finish! Father Mods and Fly Like an Eagle will be getting two kills there for Mob, and, and Commando Delta wins that attack round with about a second left. That is amazing. Deploying in 10 seconds. They say fortune favors the bold, but that was really bold to hold on to those last few moments. Mob is going to repeat First Floor Kitchen. This time, Showcase is open. That opens up another opportunity for Commando Delta on the attack. Ooh, Jess Chili gets Slay X. And, and Hendrix was not exactly covering the side there. It's just Chili gets taken out by Flex. That refrag there will be valuable. And I think there might have been a sticky cam I just caught a glimpse of. Oh, like an eagle gets the nade in there to get flex. It's 3v4. Hendrix will go ahead and swap out for the Mac 10. Ooh, Crusader, nasty with that shotgun, gets a kill through the window. Other mods is left defending the site on his own there and has trouble coming from the end of the hall. Well, I can eagle get a C4 kill on Crusader. Oh, throwing the nade out there. He's Father Mods is gonna get a little bit more aggressive against the shield. 
But you know there's another gunner down there at the end. I, I would not challenge that. Yeah, Artis is going to try to pre-fire upstairs. Fly like an eagle is once again holding the top of the stairs. His father Mod just gets enough of Hendrix to take him out. But now it is 1v3. A aggressive push coming up here, it seems, from... Oh, no, Medtech is actually a little further than I thought. And Father Mods will get Artist tied up 1-1. Four mob, it's Father Mods and Fly Like an Eagle with four kills each. Mando Delta is a little bit spread out. We have two kills for Slay X Artists and Flex. As a whole, nine kills for Mob. Use the planning table seven kills for Commando Delta. Uh, it looked like Tony Montana might have been starting to try to wedge the double doors there, but thought twice about it. Deploying in ten seconds. Black and Eagle is going to set up at the top of this staircase. As per his MO. Ooh, Fly Like an Eagle gets a dirty kill there against Crusader, that angle. Crusader's entry struggles continue. We see what he can do with the shotgun when he doesn't get killed right away. But that, that seems to be his biggest holdback right now, is just you know being that first death so often. And Hendrix will take point with the shield. That is Father Mods on the other end of that. Playaxe will now push in through Elders, uh, making that noise there. It's going to make even more noise, blasting the door open with C2. And Tony Montana just sees the flash of the C2 exploding. And Slayax will go ahead and get that kill. Hendrix moves aside for Slayax to... Uh, Get the shots in on, um, excuse me, Father Mods. Now avoiding that entirely, Father Mods has got his back turned. Hendrix could push in here. Now, yeah, Father Mods comes back out. Now realizes they have pushed in and Slayax gets enough to see Father Mods and get the kill. 3v3. Fly Like an Eagle is the only one playing off the objective floor right now. Making sure there's no push coming up from some anywhere else. All of Commando Delta is on the floor, or at least viewing the floor, hanging out of the side there as artist. In this 3v3 scenario, if Commando Delta is aware it's 3v3, this is where I would like to see maybe Hendrix pick up a gun. Because he does not have Slay X behind him anymore. Father like Eagle is still down below. Now hearing that repel as Artis is going to set up to repel just to the left of just Chili here. You see behind that screen is the door that Artis will be coming in through. Fly Like an Eagle is going to challenge outside. And pushing in is Artis right at the same time that Hendrix comes in with the shield. That'll be enough of a distraction for Artis to get the kill on just Chili. Smart push there by Commando Delta coming in at the same time. Now Fly Like an Eagle has sight of the objective. Hendrix will go out to meet Eagle. Behind him is Slay X. That's a good gun to have behind you. And... Oh! Slay X gets Fly like an Eagle off to the right! Comes out Medtech, who'll get Slay X back! And then you'll see Artis firing in through the door, turtling as Hendrix still working on the defuse, and he doesn't get stopped. Medtech will go ahead and uh, have to suffer the loss here for a seat. Well, Mob will, excuse me, but Medtech will have to do that, uh, you know try to survive on his own there and uh that is a two a 
attack round wins for Commando Delta, and we're seeing Commando Delta come in strong on the attack now, both in the last game and in this one. And there, this is cause for concern if you're mob now that Commando Delta is going uh, to be on defense. Both of these teams are good defenders. Commando Delta is probably one of the best when it comes to defending. And now that mob has spawned in, first floor kitchen is the first objective. Taking point is Father Mods with that shield. Crusader is there with the side of shotgun, but the spawn peak barrier is still there. So Crusader is going to try to run away from that. But Father Mods will go ooh, unscarred. Then so focused on Crusader misses the shots coming from down the hall. I believe, yeah, that was Slay X down there. Now you got three stacked up on the showcase entrance. Slay X might be missing. Oh, and Nate is going out, and that might be perfect to get a three. Oh, it's still the spawn peak barrier. He gets med tech though. Now having to back away. Hendrix will get just chilly. That was up in the staircase. Nate goes out by Father Mods, and he is down to 61 health. Oh, this nade, ooh, just short of Slay X. Now Father Mods has pushed in. Lex will get Father Mods. And it's just Tony Montana and Eagle left. Eagle's up in the first floor storage as Tony Montana is going to commit to the showcase entrance. Perhaps, try yeah, he's gonna go to try to get the scar instead of the ES-36 he was just holding on to. It's probably not a bad idea in your first attack round to try to go ahead and get the ES-36 out of your inventory and maybe try to hold on to that scar. But he's going to continue to challenge here. Looks like uh, Lex is the one now holding that angle. Well, like an eagle's in trouble a little bit there, but uh, Tony Montana will get Flex over in Showcase. It is 2v4. As Tony Montana does the first bit of uh, damage here against Commando Delta. And I think he encountered a bug. Yep. <laughs> Sometimes when you repel while leaning, it doesn't fully take you over. So I think he was trying to get onto the rooftop and stop leaning, stop leaning. Okay. Well, he got over. Okay. If you like lean into it, it might mess up that way. Minute and a half left. Oh, like an eagle is going to unload into kitchen. I don't believe any of those really. Oh, I think Hendrix actually, he might have gotten hit by that. He's at 61. Wasn't sure what he had earlier. Oh, Montana catches artist off guard. Black and Eagle will come back to challenge 90 as Tony Montana is in the maid's hallway. Oh, and Slay X sees enough of Black and Eagle to get him. And Montana will come back to get Slay X. Also getting Crusader. It is now 1v1. Hendrix should see exactly. Oh, he just. He missed Montana on the ground. They trade. And nobody got points for that one. We will continue the game as uh, we'll progress through normally, but sometimes when these things happen in the game, you just got to continue going on and then we can resolve it later. But you would assume that Commando Delta should have gotten those points because normally in trades, the defense is awarded the, uh, the round because the bomb still has not been defused. 
So the score could potentially be 1-3 right now, but that's just sometimes how the game works. Deploying in 10 seconds. Locate and defuse the bomb. The, the other thing, too, is so... Because no one was awarded points, Commando Delta is able to choose that first floor kitchen again. So we just gotta play it out as the game allows. It is early access. You gotta accept it for what it is sometimes. Eagle's the only one on that showcase. He will take out the 90 cam as Just Chili takes out the stair cam. Father Mods with that shield uh, is going to try to avoid the frag. He will avoid the frag successfully, and Just Chili will cover to get Hendrix. Flex throws an A down the hall. That doesn't get anybody, but Artist will take out Medtech, who's shooting from storage. It's 4v4. And Father Mods will get Slay X with the nade. Just chilly watching for any trouble coming from up above. Oh no! The one Tony Montana was shooting into kitchen and gets his own teammate out. Father Mods gets taken out. Oh, and Crusader gets. A sawed-off shotgun kill on Fly Like an Eagle, who does eventually push in through so Showcase. And, ooh, there's a nade, or C4, for the uh, flash of Montana. That C4 will take him out, and Artis will get the kill on Just Chili. And now the score is 1v3. Sorry, 1-3 is the score, with Commando Delta in the lead. We do have to play, I mean, the way that the game's programmed, we do have to play until somebody gets five rounds. But the score could potentially be 1-4. 7 kills for Slayx, 6 kills for Flylike and Eagle. Uh, pretty much... And would you expect anything else? Flex sets up a door trap there. In ten and the drawing room entrance. Locate and defuse the bomb. You're going to see uh, Mob is going to spread out quite a bit here. You've got Medtech over there just now looking at Showcase. Father Mod's coming up on the power stairs. Just Chili over in the drawing room. And Father Mod's gets a shotgun kill on Hendrix. On entry. Oh, Fly Like an Eagle reacted maybe a little bit too fast. Unfortunately, doesn't seem to do that much damage, if any, to Father Mods. Might have just been able to flick out of the way. Layax will pick up a kill on Medtech. Evening it up. Aggressive push here coming up by both Father Mods and Tony Montana. Coming up to the 90. 
and Tony Montana will get this frag kill on Slay X, shootout artist, and shootout crusader. That was just a three piece in a matter of seconds. That leaves Flex on his own in the dining room. Oh, just seeing there, he's shooting the table a lot and gets taken out by just Chili from the rear. Peeking in through the window. Scores 3-2. Playx with eight kills and the one Tony Montana with seven kills now. Look at that damage near a thousand. Once again, this this will most definitely be reviewed afterwards, uh, depending on the result. <laughs> but uh, score could be four two with Commando Delta in the lead right now. Use the planning table to find the bomb. Commando Delta now on the attack. Deploying in ten seconds. Locate and defuse the bomb. Medtech has got the trouble of three in front of him. I would not open that door. I wouldn't even stand there. Has to deal with the shield up front, and he's getting charged by Hendrix. That'll be an entry kill with the shield by Hendrix. Now taking out the camera at the stairs. Tony Montana will reposition himself. Now, I wonder why Eagle's holding the pantry there, because uh, this early in the game. He knows nobody's going to be over there as Montana gets a kill on Slay X. Slay X has been taken out early a little bit. Oh! Final Mods is going away from showcases. Artist pushes in. And Tony Montana's down to 16 health. Flex will take out Jess Chili. Father Mo uh, the one time Montana has no problem challenging Artist with the frag. Only 16 health for Tony Montana. And he just went out there and said, here, have this. Flex is trying his best to quick peek here and, and not get taken out. Either that or just, like, warming up to do it. Power gets cut off. Both Fly Like an Eagle and Tony Montana are doing a good job holding the 90 from, from split angles. Tony Montana has only 16 health. Probably should not be peeking right now. Just let the attack come to you. This angle right here for Eagle is going to cause Commando Delta a lot of trouble. The best bet for them is to relocate through Showcase and come through Maids, assuming that that entry is open. Which I believe Flex... Yeah, that entry should be open. And now they're in a better position if Flex can squeeze in there. Coming up right behind Eagle. Yep. Oh. Yeah, now Eagle realizes he's in trouble. Crusader will go ahead and get Fly Like an Eagle. Montana will get Flex and Crusader. Crusader gets Tony Montana, though, as well, on the trade. And that will be all of Mob eliminated. Hendrix will go ahead and defuse the bomb. Potentially the game winner right here, making it 5-2. But this game is likely going to continue. Because early access. <laughs> So, we are potentially looking at
Commando Delta's second game win of the season here right now in game number two against Mob. If the game gets called here, these are your scores. Eight kills for SlayX, six kills for Artist, 11 kills for the 120 Montana. Boy, did he pop off in this game. Father Mods with six and Eagle with six. Use the planning table to find the bomb. Artist also with six. It's been kind of a quieter, below the radar kind of fellow. But he's got some good numbers to talk about, too. Deploying in 10 seconds. I mean, they, they, we only have so much time to talk about people during the pregame. Some people just kind of like fly underneath the the, the radar. But Arnis does pretty well. I mean, he's got a 57.4% cost with a, a KDR of 0.77. He played some games against Chimera Crew, which that'll hurt your KDR. The way Chimera Crew has just been unbelievably taking over this league. And Commando Delta seems to be getting better as the season goes along. Flex will take out just Chili with the M4. Hendrix was struggling to find the nade there. And does <laughs> oh does block the C4, keeping it in front of him. C2 charge gets placed. Not sure from where. Uh, that's why I can eagle up there up top. As SlayX will get the kill there on Father Mods from the long angle. Now, Eagle will retreat back up to the top where he's been playing. It is a 4v3. Now, Fall Like an Eagle hears what's coming upstairs, and ooh, <laughs> just misses Crusader swinging across. Coming back, the Eagle's got a pinch from below and below uh, and above. Hendrix coming up with the shield, now getting on the ground. Up top is going to be Crusader. He's going to come in and get Eagle with the shotgun. Dang, yeah, got himself trapped there. Medtech is down to 38 health, taking fire. Tony Montana charges on SlayX and tries to get him behind Commando Delta. Getting pushed by Hendrix. Gets knocked out by Hendrix's uh, shield. Did not get that frag out. Medtech is down to 22 health, having a face on... Three of Commando Delta. Oh, 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 oh! Sweet Jesus! I mean, that was nasty looking right there. This this little angle that Medtech had to hold. Hendrix just came out a little bit too much. So, your second possible final score is 5-2. It's either 5-2 in 7 rounds or 5-2 in 8 rounds. If it's 5-2 in 8 rounds, your final score here is SlayX with 9 kills, Crusader with 7, Artist with 6, Flex with 5, and Hendrix with 4. For Mob, you had the one Tony Montana with 12 kills. Remember, he had that team kill earlier, so he actually would have had 13 kills. Father Mods and Fly Like an Eagle with six kills each, and Just Chili and Medtech with three kills.